Okay, Christian, we see carbon fibre in all sorts of uh, applications in motor racing and beyond, but you've got something here with B-Comp that has the potential to change the game. Correct, uh, we believe so. Um, indeed, we have developed a, a natural fibre composite. So we, we use flax, which has uh, very good intrinsic properties per se. And then we, we build it up. We have developed specific textile architectures, which, which allows us to um, enhance this, the properties and actually outperform carbon for specific applications, uh, such as body parts in motorsports. Can you just give us some specifics about how it outperforms carbon fiber and the benefits that B-Comp brings? Sure. So um, the, uh, the flax has a, a model like a stiffness a bit like glass, but at half the density. So um, in engineering, we, we, we call that specific stiffness properties. So we start already with a material that has very interesting specific stiffness properties. Um, and then we, instead of smearing the material into the surface, we organize it on the B side, on the back side of the material. Um, we, have, we have managed to organize like a ribbed structure. So think of it a bit like the, the, the veins on the leaf. Um, using minimal material to build maximum bending stiffness, uh, and and doing doing so, we manage actually to to build a flexural stiffness that's corresponding to what you would get with a very high modulus material like carbon, uh, but just like smeared into the surface basically. So that's really the approach. Where are we currently seeing B Comp competing around the world, and where are we likely to see it in the near future? So we the whole thing actually started a bit as a cheesy startup story in a in a Swiss garage um, with the ambition to make a ski slider. So we first actually took balsa, the lightest uh, wood on the planet, and we used flax um, to reinforce it to make it usable as a core material uh, in the ski industry. So that's how what we built the company on. Like we started now seven and a half years ago. Uh, so we developed the, the lightest ski wood core in the market, uh, launched it. Now we have uh, customers like K2 or Black Diamond using using those cores in their in their um, in their high performance uh, touring or free riding skis. Two years ago, we really said, okay, now we go full speed into mobility mar markets, the mobility sector, because we have um, solutions actually that can solve a lot of, of uh, weight problems also in the mobility sector. Uh, and there we have we have different things. So we have. One thing is um, in automotive interior, so we talk about large-scale um, uh, cars. Think of door panels or front panels or also um, trim, uh, trim parts in the, in the rear of, of the car. And then we said, okay, the, the motorsport sector is actually a very interesting platform because we have this very speedy kind of DNA in terms of bringing products to market very quickly within the sports and leisure industry. And we said, okay, motorsports actually offers that. You know, you, there is this, this tremendous development speed. Um, it is an innovative innovation platform for, for the automotive sector. So uh, it allows us, it allowed us to, to step into that mobility sector very quickly, uh, generate a lot of content uh, also for the large scale automotive sector. Uh, and you know, getting fit really for the for, for the requirements in terms of quality management and in, ter in terms of supply chain um, that the the automotive sector brings to us. And I guess being here at PMW, it's the perfect platform for you to showcase this product to a wide range of customers, manufacturers, and privateers. Absolutely, it has been tremendous. And honestly, for me, it has been now. I mean, since the foundation of Bcom seven years ago, I think it's the it's the show um, with the, the the where we feel the greatest pull. Uh, and not only it's not you know it's not a quantity you, you it's not a quantity question because often you you come home from the so, show and you have this this feeling that you you talked a lot and you, that you generate a tremendous amount of leads but then if you actually look at the quality uh, you you understand that you spend a lot of time talking for not you know not really uh, building your business uh, and here what I appreciate is this combination of very high quality and also a fair a fair quantity so uh, it's you know 80 percent of the leads we generate are, are of high quality uh, and it as you, I mean it has been a tremendous platform and uh, we feel like you know. Things are really picking up. I think we have we reached a tipping point now where we will see in the coming months uh, more and more of our materials in this in this exciting sector.